So Lake Charles, Louisiana received over a foot of rain yesterday. 12.49 inches, wanted to include every single number left and right of the decimal. Easily had one of your rainiest days on record. Uh, on the flip side, San Diego, California also had a record amount of rain yesterday. Two one hundredths of an inch. That's all it takes for a record this time of the year near San Diego, California. We still got plenty more heavy rain to go. States like Texas, Oklahoma, Arkansas, and Louisiana. Essentially three inches to a half a foot of rain with locally heavier amounts are possible for the next two or so days. Remember flash flooding issues? Turn around, don't drown. Never drive through any flooded roadways. Risk of severe weather's out as well. We had a number of large hail, damaging wind, and even tornado reports near the Texas Panhandle with that moderate risk yesterday. Today, it's a slight, to, a marginal to slight risk, so isolated to scattered severe storms are possible. Still be weather aware. Large hail, damaging winds, a tornado or two can't be ruled out. Cities like Dallas, Houston, Kansas City, Little Rock, Arkansas included in those risks of severe weather as this front is not moving much. Eventually, it will surge north and east, but until then, we're stuck with it. So ongoing areas of heavy rain for cities like Dallas and surrounding areas will be possible. Looking at your highs today, 78, so that chance of rain really impacting your high temperatures. Flash flood watch continues today. Winter storm watch in the blue shade is noted. Starting on Wednesday, lasts all the way through Saturday. We're talking around a foot plus of, of snowfall in the higher elevations of the Rockies. There's Montana right there. There's that chance of snowfall in the dark blue. The Cascade Mountains might be in for some heavy rain starting tomorrow as well. And this morning, wrapping up a little bit of snow in areas of the Rockies, west of, Col west of Denver and Colorado Springs, Colorado. So again, areas of Texas, Louisiana, Arkansas, and Oklahoma. We're keeping eyes, close ones, on chances of heavy rain, strong and severe weather again today.